Got a little job. Got to see if I can put these wheel bearings in and put these seals in in my boat trailer. Cause I'm wanting to go fishing. Got to pack a little grease in them. I never did know just exactly the proper way to do this. So I'm just gonna give it my best shot. They say that these seals are the tricky part. Wish me luck. So far, so good. I might have given the impression in some of my other videos that Miss Janice has always given me stuff to do to keep me from going fishing and playing in the great outdoors that God has blessed us with. But she's a pretty good old girl. She got in this evening and jumped on the lawnmower and started cutting grass so I could put these bearings in this evening. So I wouldn't have to cut grass tomorrow so I might can make me a fishing trip before the rain tomorrow evening. I think I'll keep her. Well, I believe I got the bearings in. Now, I just need to go put the tires on the trailer. Y'all just look at there. We got wheels on old putt put again. But take a look out yonder. We got Miss Janice cutting grass for us. good this morning. I can't keep up. <laughs> Let's cast her back down there. I got a bite on the soap. <laughs> yeah, buddy. I made a video a little while back about fishing with this soap. I had caught fish with soap soap before on trot lines, but I'd never caught them on rod and reel. And I still had some of this old soap in the boat. And it done faded out. It wasn't mean pink no more. It was white. And somebody told me I wasn't using a big enough piece. So I put three pieces on the hook, I think, and threw it out there. Got that soap soap. I guess you can catch catfish on soap after all. I sure am glad Miss Janice cut the grass for me yesterday evening where I could go fishing this morning. The Lord really did bless me this morning. Time to, to lay out a few catfish. And always remember, whether you're at work or play, I hope you have a nice day. This is Bill Reddick Outdoors. See y'all.